Hi guys, welcome to TechPaste. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the new file explorer that is present in the beta channel of the Windows Insider program. Basically, a new section added to the home page, which adds some new tabs with more information. And I'm going to show you how to enable that in this video. So if you enjoy videos like these, where I show you how to enable different hidden features and other features, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechPaste channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, as always, we're going to have to set up Vivetool. Just get Vivetool from the article below in the video description make sure to get the latest version that's it you can then open up using file explorer click on extract all click on browse and then make sure to extract it into a dedicated folder for example in local disk c i created a folder called hidden features i'm just going to extract it here and then i'm going to copy the location because we're going to need it whenever we're running the commands click on extract in my case i'm going to have to replace the files in the destination and we are good to go this is how easily you can set up vive tool which is a small tool that can help you enable certain features that are slowly rolling out in windows now we're going to have to open up the search box, type in here CMD, and then right click on CMD and then run as administrator. On user account control, of course, click on yes. In CMD, we're going to have to copy and paste in one command, five tool slash enable slash ID or five one three zero four eight three, and then press enter. You should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. Shout out to Phantom Ocean 3 for discovering the ID and this hidden feature. You can follow him on his Twitter from the pinned comment below. And also this command will be in the article below in the video description. So you can just copy and paste it from there. And we are good to go. Now we can exit out from the CMD and make sure you restart your computer for the changes take effect. Now if we open up the file explorer after the restart, you're going to notice this new section in the bottom of the home page. We have three new tabs, recent favorites and also shared. I think this is pretty interesting and we have the recent files, the favorite files. Basically we can pin files here as favorites and then the shared section. When a file is shared with your account, you'll be able to quickly access it here. I think this could be also pretty useful. Related to the favorite section, if we go for example and in the video section we can right click on a file click on add to favorites and if we go to home and then favorites you're going to notice that the file will be present here and of course Microsoft is working on improving this even further this is not even an official announced feature it's only hidden in this build but we will have more info about the files like the date access to file location which we already have activity and maybe more and recent files as you can see we have info such as the name data access file location and also activity so this is basically how easily you can enable this new file explorer homepage inside the latest build for the better channel and make sure to get five tool and also the command that i've used in this video from the article below in the video's description if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one was your money from tech base until next time have a nice day